Starlight, star bright. This evening, you'll have another chance to spot an impressive string of lights in the sky over Massachusetts. The lights are a string of satellites actually launched by SpaceX. And if you time it right, you'll be able to follow them in the night sky. The bright parade of lights getting a lot of attention. Here's WBZ meteorologist Jacob Wyckoff with more on how and when to see them. As a meteorologist, I'm often telling people to look up, but tonight I really mean it. Let me explain. Two days ago, SpaceX launched its 69th installation of Starlink satellites. And lift off. Starlink satellites are sent into orbit to deliver internet to rural and remote spots around the world, like on the front lines in Ukraine. Now, days after the launch, this site. What the heck is that? Lighting up the WBZ phone lines and the night sky. This is a Starlink cluster lit up by the sun. In the coming days, SpaceX will turn the devices to dim them. But if you do want to check them out, we have some good viewing opportunities over the next few days. Tonight at 6.30 or so, look to the west and you should see them. Tomorrow, same story around 6.45. If you ever want to track these orbits yourself, visit findstarlink.com. Looking up, meteorologist Jacob Wyckoff, WBZ News. And you saw him last night. I, we get so many phone calls about this. The funny story is, and bring Eric in on this as well, several months ago, late at night, I happened to be outside and I saw them. I ran to get my phone, because I didn't know what it was, and I went to go take some video and my phone shut off just as I took video. And that's when you thought, there's something there's going There's something on out here. there. There's something <laughs> out there. It is interesting, Eric, and Elon was like, nope, and <laughs> right. dimmed your phone right so. off. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's an interesting sight. I mean, it's really, if you don't know what it is, you're like, Oh my goodness, what, what is happening here? And you know, some people are really into it because it's providing a service. Others who are maybe astrophotographers who are trying to take pictures. There's a lot more up there in space these days than there used to be. And so pros and cons. But uh, tonight, 630, that's where you have a good chance of checking out some of those satellites in the air.